Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome. Um, if you're new here, my name is Kiana. I make lifestyle videos, vlogs, and new mom content. Today I am so excited because we're finally gonna begin nesting. So we did a few things last night. We actually got the dresser delivered and um, our mattress delivered for the crib. And Juan ended up building them last night. And then I washed a bunch of stuff. I washed the crib sheets, the blankets, um, all her burp cloths. I also washed all her newborn clothes and zero to three months, like the sleepers and all that. So I can start with the nesting today and organizing the drawers. That's pretty much what I wanna get done today. I wanna do all the drawers or as much as I can, and then we'll see where we go from there. So I would love to give you a little overview of what the room looks like right now, but her name sign is up, so I don't really wanna be taking it on and off. So I'll give you a quick little rundown of what it looks like and then I'll try to like cut the name out. Okay, so this is what the room looks like right now. All right, so we have the crib right here. This is the Baby Leto crib that I mentioned in another vlog. And then we have the Newton mattress. Then this muslin crib sheet. This is from Mushi, I believe. And then I washed all her burp cloths and um, washed cloths yesterday. So this is here just so I can fold it. But I wanted to wait for the vlog to do that. Um, so I'm going to do that. And then these are all her newborn and zero to three months clothes and sleepers. I washed this blanket. So it looks super cute. And then we also put together the bouncer yesterday. This is from Baby Delight. It's super cute. I love the neutral color and it goes really good with the wall color. And then we have our rocker chair that we put together the other day. This is also from Baby Leto. I believe it's the, I'm not sure what the name of it. I will have everything linked below, but it goes up and down. It's a glider. So it swivels, it rocks, all the things. And then this pillow is actually my breast feeding pillow. It's from Snuggle Me. Um, but I think it looks so cute, kind of like moon shaped. So I have that there for now. I got this cute little thing from Target yesterday to have her like laundry. I didn't want anything too big, but that's just something easy. I also want to get curtains. That's something that we still need to get. Um, and I, I don't want to get blackout curtains um, necessarily, but maybe some cute like sheer curtains for this area because the light looks really nice in here in the morning. It's very like, like the sun comes up from this side. So I love the light that comes in here. So I feel like maybe like an off-white or like cream color sheer curtains would look nice. Here we have the dresser. This I got from Amazon. This is from the brand Carter's by Da Vinci. I believe it's what it's called. It's the natural wood color. Um, I'm obsessed with it. It has six drawers, it comes out. Super nice. And then we have the Kikaru that I finally opened yesterday since we have the dresser together. That's the changing pad. This is like a rubbery soft material. So it's nice and comfy for the baby. And then it's very easy to wipe. So if, so if she has any blowouts or anything. And then this mirror is actually, this mirror was in our room but we decided to move it in here because I love the color. I wasn't able to find any and I really didn't want to buy a new one when we literally have one. So this is a, from Target, the Hearth and Hand, I believe. Target has mirrors like this, but they're like $70. So we didn't really feel like buying a brand new one for the nursery when we have the exact one that I wanted in our bedroom, so. And then here is one of the diaper caddies. We have two of these. The other one, this isn't set up, it's just a bunch of stuff that um, we got from our baby shower. It's not organized yet. We got two. We have this one and then I have another one um, that I'm going to keep in our bedroom for when she comes because obviously we're going to have the bassinet in our room and stuff like that. This is a weighted wiper holder. So it has this thing, has like a little weight um, so that... Whenever you're pulling out wipes, it's not like moving around all over the place. It's from Ubi. Um, that's from Amazon too, it was like 10 bucks. So definitely worth it. We also put together her swing yesterday. This is um, from Maxi Cozy. Um, so it swings kind of like back and forth. 
has five different settings, so I'm excited for that. And then this is her closet right now. The drawer kind of, I mean the dresser is kind of in the way of the door, but it doesn't bother me. This is her closet so far. I have the organizers here. I got two of them because I, they only come with five, so I didn't know how much I was going to be needing. And then these are more organizers. They're like little cubes or squares. This thing I got from Target um, along with the, thing, the, what are they called? Bin drawers, I guess? I don't know. Um, but this is just some extra storage. We can put her carriers in here, anything extra. Nothing is organized right now. We just have like random stuff in here. Oh, I have her diaper bag. This is all set up. I love this diaper bag. It's from Itsy Ritzy. So it's kind of like a little puffer bag. You can wear it as a backpack, but I have the those things tucked in the back. Um, you could wear it up here. It has stroller straps that I put in a drawer. It has so many pockets, pockets on the side. I got this thing from Itsy Ritzy too. Um, it's like a pacifier holder, so that was cute. Has a changing pad and everything. This is super cute. And then our baby Brezza is right there, the sterilizer. Um, but we're not sterilizing anything yet. And then we have some stuff up there, so yeah. So we have a few things to do, but I want to get started first. I want to focus on a couple things at a time. So today I want to get done the most of the drawers in the dresser, like putting away her sleepers and all the burp cloths and washcloths and stuff. I still need to wash her towels. She has a lot of towels that I want to wash and put in the dresser as well or put in one of the bins. I'm not really sure yet, but I want to start with that first and then we can go from there. I also have to leave. It's like three o'clock now. I have to go pick up Cooper's food um, at PetSmart but they were out of the food that we get there, so I had to go to a different location. So I have to go to a different location and it's further away. And I can only pick that up at seven. So I'm thinking about going now and then come back and start nesting. Cause once I get in the mode of like organizing and stuff, I don't want to stop. So we're going to do that. All right, I'm in the car. I am on the way to PetSmart to go get Cooper food. Listening to a podcast, I listened to full coverage um, with Laura, Laura Lee and Manny MUA. Oh my God, I love their podcast so much. They're so funny. They both have me dying all the time. So yeah, I'm going to listen to that and I might stop at Starbucks, like I said. A refresher sounds good. So let's head to Starbucks. All right, I got a 40 minute drive ahead of me, so love that for me. All right, I just picked up Cooper's food. Um, and now I have a 47 minute ride back home because there's traffic now, so. Oh, oh my God, I almost spilled my Starbucks all over my car. I will see you guys back at home. I'm finally back home. It's literally like almost five o'clock. 4.54. Got what I needed to get and now we can finally start the nesting process. I also got these wood shelves on Amazon. The ones that look like this that I feel like every nursery has. Um, I got those shelves but I'm kind of annoyed because I expected them to be built already and then me just have to like put them on the wall but they're not. It's like a whole thing which I'm sure I could do but I just don't really feel like doing that right now so but I wanted to see like where I wanted to put them because I still don't really know where I want to put them but yeah let's start this nesting process all right so I have some newborn wipes here um, we only got one box of 84 because I don't know how big she's gonna be so I'm gonna open this and then I have a bunch of these honest wipes I have I think Four right here I'm gonna start with to put in the drawers all right so I have these organizers put this up here Now I have 
have all those muslin brick cloths over there in the crib. Um, so I'm just gonna roll them up and then put them on the other side. I have 10 of each color. So I have white and then I have this cute little blush color. So I'm gonna fold these. Okay, so, so far I have newborn pampers, wipes, and then I have burp cloths, and then on the side I have washcloths. I had like a little bit of space here, so I was like, let me just put the washcloths. They're like square and smaller. And then the rest of the burp cloths I'm just going to put in either one of the bins in the closet or in um, one of the other drawers down here. So, but I love how this came out. Looks so good. On to the next one. All right, so next I'm working on this drawer. I have these little organizers from Amazon. They like zip at the bottom. And then, yeah, there's like small ones, larger ones. I'm gonna put all her bows in here. Um, so that would be cute. I don't know how I'm gonna put it yet. I don't know if I'm gonna do it this way or if I'm gonna do it this way yet. So I'm still trying to figure that out, but. Okay, so I found a couple more bow or headbands, headband bows. So I'm gonna add those to here and then all the pacifiers and stuff, I'm gonna unbox. So I'm gonna do that right now and then I'll be right back. So I think I'm done for right now. I'm gonna take a break. It's about to get dark and I need to take Cooper out on a walk before it does get dark. Um, so when I come back inside, I think I'm gonna put the towels in the wash and then I'm gonna continue this tomorrow. So yeah, this is what we have so far. I'm really excited. I put a couple things in the diaper caddy too. This is just soaps and stuff. And then diapers, I don't know exactly what I'm gonna put in there just yet. But here's the first drawer we have the burp cloths, washcloths on the side, diapers, um, wipes I mean, and then diapers. And then this drawer we have all her bows and headbands here, pacifiers, pacifiers, clips. And then we have these things which clip onto the pacifier. They like came with them, but I took them out. All the health stuff, the Aquaphor baby, nail file, diaper brush cream, all that. Gripe water, thermometer, this is like the health stuff. And then this this drawer, we have the newborn footies, um, zero to three month footies, like sleepers. And then here we have the newborn body suits. So this is like short sleeve, long sleeve, but they don't have the foot part. We have the zero to three month body suits. That's all we have right now. Um, so. I don't know if I'm going to keep it like this. I kind of like it. I don't know if this is enough newborn footies. So I'm torn on if I need to buy some more newborn or zero to three months because I just don't know how big she's going to be. So I don't know yet. But yeah, this is what we have so far. And then I'm going to wash the towels. I have her blankets down here, the muslin blankets slash swaddles. I might put more clothes in this drawer. I'm not sure yet. And then I want to put towels there too. So I still, I have to think about 
where I want to put stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm going to take a break, like I said, take Cooper out, and then I will see you guys tomorrow when it's lighter and brighter because it's getting darker and the lighting is getting bad anyways, so. All right, so it's the next day, and I pretty much did everything. I was taking a break last night when I last saw you guys, and then I randomly got a burst of energy at like 10 o'clock, and I decided to like finish the drawers and all of that, separate the towels. Um, so I was doing that. She has a lot of towels, so I was basically just like cutting the tags off of all of them last night, and then I put them in the wash and the washcloths as well. And then this morning, I like put everything in the drawers. Everything is pretty much done for now. There's still a couple things that we have to get, but I will show you what we have now. I'm super happy with it. It looks so freaking cute in here and cozy. So yeah, let me show you. Okay, so when you walk in, you see the crib. Um, we have the little blanket. This thing was from one of the gifts I got for my baby shower. I'm just hanging it there for now as decoration, but when the baby starts to actually sleep in there, I'll take that off, obviously. Um, the mattress is a Newton mattress. I think I told you guys that yesterday. And then the crib sheet is a muslin crib sheet. It's from Mushy. And then I have her cute little like stuffed animals there. And then over here we have the Baby Delight Bouncer. That's not gonna stay there. We're gonna get a side table so I can put the hatch machine and I have a picture frame with her ultrasound that I wanna put, but that's just there for now. The glider we have there, the snuggle me pillow. I have a little laundry basket that I got from Target. And then here we have our dresser. This is what I told you yesterday is from Amazon. It's the Carter's by Da Vinci um, brand. I have the hatch machine. It's not plugged in or set up or anything. I just wanted to put it somewhere until we get our side table so put it over there. And then I filled our diaper caddy. This is gonna come with us in our bedroom whenever she's here. Um, I just filled some stuff in it. I have diapers. I'm gonna put wipes in it. Um, we have a changing mat here. Here's some lotion, rash cream. I have burp cloths in here. And then I have just her combs. This is just gonna sit here for now. But like I said, when the baby comes, I'm gonna swap some things out. Obviously put wipes in here. I want to put like an extra onesie or two in there, <clears throat> take the lotions out, stuff like that. And then you guys saw me do the top two drawers yesterday. This is the diaper slash burp cloth drawer. I love this drawer so much. This one's my favorite. It has all the newborn diapers, wipes, and then burp cloths. And on these on the side are washcloths. There are two layers too, so you can never have too many burp cloths. So I love this drawer so much. And this one is all her like health stuff and bows. We have, this is full of her bows. She has a lot of bows and headbands, which I'm so excited for. There's like so many different colors. Um, pacifiers, I have not sterilized those yet. I'm waiting until it gets closer, obviously. I think I'm gonna keep this like this. Um, I might change a few things, but I'm liking how that one looks so far. And then the second one is our sleepers. All of these are going to be the newborn sleepers and footies. They're all zippers. Here is going to be newborn bodysuits and onesies, so they're like short sleeve. And then here are the zero to three month bodysuits that we had. We didn't have a lot, so I ended up just putting another small container here with socks. There's a few hats in there that I haven't washed. Um, so yeah, socks and hats is in this one for now. I might change this one only because I want to buy a couple more newborn onesies and a couple more zero to three month like the sleeper footies um just so she has more because i'm not sure if this is enough but i want to get more of each just in case to be safe so i like the organization of this but we might like change where some things are <sighs> so out of breath and i'm wearing my belly band you can't see it because i'm wearing black but anyways and then this, I have all her bath stuff. Like I said earlier, she had she got a lot of towels. And then I have um, bubble bath, shampoo and body wash. This is like all her soaps. This was a sample CeraVe wash and shampoo that I got from that Amazon registry. I have a couple of the washcloths back there. So that's all nice and organized. And then this bottom one is just all her blankets and 
slash swaddles. These are all the muslin blankets on the left side um, that we can also use as swaddles. And then blankets on the right. This my friend got me, it has her name on it. It's really cute. Um, this one is cute. And then this one is like a lovey, it's really soft. It kind of has like a bunny and then it's like a small baby size blanket. So I'm excited to use that one. And then this last drawer is all my postpartum slash breast feeding stuff, um, nursing stuff. So I have on the right side all the Freedom Mom stuff that I got, the boy shorts, all that. The kit came with all of this stuff except for the, the Perry bottle, which is back here. So I have all of this. And then here I have my LV Curve, my Haka. I have some nipple butter. And then I got these breast um, pads, the nursing pads, I think, that also came in that Amazon thing. Um, this is where I'm going to put my breast pump whenever I get one and any other stuff that is helping me with nursing slash breastfeeding. And then I'm sure this drawer will change at some point, but I like how it is right now. And then I put the um, diaper genie right here. We didn't put the bag in it or anything. We just like put it here for now. And then this is her closet. I put um, our extra diapers back there. We have the diaper bag here, the snuggle me back there, and then the baby Brezza that we're gonna use to sterilize the bottles um, once it gets closer. Um, here I just have extra burp cloths, washcloths, um, all of that in here. This is like an extra pair of socks, like a pack of socks. And then that is a muslin blanket slash swaddle that we got from Amazon. It was like a zebra print, but I didn't wash it, so I didn't want to put it in the drawer. I washed everything that I put in the drawer, so that's nice. And this one, I just have like kind of miscellaneous stuff. This is the diaper genie bags that it came with. I have an extra diaper caddy just in case I need one. Um, this is for her bath. It helps with like the water flow or something. I have another hooded bath towel that didn't fit in the drawer. Extra newborn diapers. And then this was a sample diaper that we got from that Amazon thing. And then this one is just our bottles. Um, we have bottles here, bottles here. This is a bottle warmer. Underneath there I have a car monitor and then we have the baby monitor. These two are the, are the bottles that we got from the Amazon registry box. It's good. And then here I have our Tush Baby and the Baby Carrier. Um, and then also there's a Mom Cozy Stroller Caddy that we're going to use for our Nuna stroller. So I'm excited for that. So this is just like that kind of stuff. I have the Kikaru. Um, this goes with the Kikaru to kind of, I guess you're supposed to like lock the baby in or something like that. And then I have some of the manuals, um, like for the Tush Baby and for the carrier, just because I didn't want to have it in the big box. So I just kept it there for when it's time for me to actually use it. Her clothes. This I'll probably put on the side table. This little thing plays You Are My Sunshine. It's the cutest thing. I got this frame because I want to put a picture of her ultrasound and put it on the side table whenever we get that. She's just a teddy bear and then this is more diapers. I think these are size like two. Yeah, they're all size two, but whoever gave them to me took them out of the box, so it's fine. I just put them up there and then this is just extra like rattle and stuff that I couldn't really find a home for it. So for her clothes, the only thing that I washed were newborn all the way to three months. I'm not washing anything past three months. Um, these are zero to three months, but these are like actual outfits. They're not like onesies or sleepers. So I held off on washing these, but I'll probably wash these as it gets closer, maybe in the next couple weeks. But the three to six months on, I'm not going to even touch until she gets here because I don't know how big she's gonna be and I have time so I'm not really worried about it and then I got these shelves in a pack on Amazon they came with four but I only put up two for now um, I put her books up whatever books that I wanted to 
display. And then here I was going to hang some cute um, outfits, maybe like two cute outfits. And then up there I'll put some little knickknacks, um, but we just put those up today, so. And then I had two more that I was thinking about putting on this wall, um, kind of like staggered, but I didn't really know how I felt about it. I kind of felt like it was too much shelving. Her mobile is coming today, the crib mobile, and that's gonna come here. So that's gonna hang like up here. So this area will be like kind of covered, um, but Maybe I can get a nice like piece of artwork or like tapestry or something that I can hang that's cute. So that's basically what we have here. I wish I could show you like the overview with the name sign because it's so cute, but not yet. I did everything pretty fast. Um, I've seen videos where they break things up into like three vlogs, but I just, I'm the type of person that I have to get everything done like at once and I like get so determined, so. We have the bassinet still in the box in the other room. We're gonna build that too, probably in the next like week or two, just to have ready in our bedroom. But other than that, I feel like we have pretty much everything that we need. There's like some small things that I still need to get, but like all the big stuff, like our car seat should be coming in a couple days. Um, but like as far as the crib, the changing pad, the dresser, like we have the stroller, like we have all the big stuff that we need. So I feel so much better. <laughs> That's pretty much it for this nesting vlog slash nursery tour because I know I didn't film doing all the nesting. So sorry, I just get random bursts of energy. I was doing this at 11 o'clock at night last night, so. But if you like this video, leave me a comment. Let me know if I forgot anything. Um, give me a like and subscribe and I'll be back with more videos.